I'm going to continue to use the reference drawing to locate the doors and windows. If you want to learn more about locating doors and windows on a new plan, please refer to the architectural tutorial series. I'm going to start by selecting the wall, right clicking, and selecting insert door. This opens up our door selection browser and I'm going to pick an exterior steel view 3O door and click OK and I can just locate this by snapping right to the location of the door on the reference drawing. I'm going to hit confirm select another wall I'll select the back wall here then go to select another door by hitting the edit parameters button we can hit the back button up at the top of the browser which lets us select a different door within the active folder or you can just pick a different folder in this case we're going to go to the patio two panel gliding and then I'm going to find the 8068 gliding door and click OK and again I can just snap to the location of the door by snapping on the reference drawing. Hit confirm and select another wall. Now I'll add the interior. So I'm going to select a different door. This one's going to be the interior cased opening. And now I'm going to add another door on the same wall, so I don't have to hit confirm. I can just select a different door. So I'm going to go back, and this time I'll pick the three foot cased opening. For the stairwell door, I'm going to change to a six panel interior. And I can change the flip. and then snap the location. And then I'll hit escape when I'm done adding my doors. And now we can continue with the windows. So I'm going to select the front wall again, right click, and this time we'll select insert window. I'll go to the generic window library and here we'll pick the clad double hung 1x and those front windows are two four four twos and we'll just snap to those locations exactly the same way we did with the doors then hit escape and we can hit F2 to see what it looks like in the 3D model. 